Hello everyone and welcome back to the Big Man Plays Star Fox and yes I just noticed that uh, when the shooting star comes across the screen it actually changes the uh, shadow on the planets there. I don't know if you can tell in the video but yeah it's, I, I noticed that because <laughs> like wow but anyway when we last left off we uh, rescued Corneria from uh, part of the invasion and now we're going to the asteroid belt. Why? Because the Astro Bell is a perfect place for bad guys to hide. And I also up the sound a little bit. Just, you know, just uh, test something here. Destroy their rock crusher. Great, I gotta destroy mining equipment. Lovely. And now, we get to see one of the other uh, uh, views. You have three different views when you fly. You have... The standard view. You have the up close view. And then of course target view. I can't call it cockpit, cockpit view because you actually don't see your cockpit while you're flying. Plus if I mention the word cockpit too many times, if I've already done so already, uh, there will be too many cockpit jokes. Oh, hello. Yes, you can destroy those green asteroids. Sometimes they have stuff, sometimes they don't. And you destroy him to shut Slippy up. I called him Peppy last time. <laughs> Guess I was a little bit hungry for rabbit stew. Let's go ahead and just take this guy. And we have these little idiots. There's also a hidden uh, warp in this area. I'll show it to you when it uh, comes up. And no, you can't destroy those uh, gray asteroids, because they're invincible! Oopsie. And we have this jumping idiot. Aha! Now, if you fly right through the middle here, we get... Damn it! Missed it. But I could have upgraded my blasters one more time. Oh, well. Now, here's the part I was talking about. You take and you blow up the middle part, the middle, uh, glowing, or gold, excuse me, asteroid in those little spinners, and... Let's see if I can make him show up. Ah, I couldn't. Oh, well. But if you actually, I, yeah, I was right. Uh, if you actually get close to the asteroids and then blow them up... Ah, oh, Slippy, not again. But if you actually get close to those asteroids and blow them up, you can actually, uh, get a very ugly asteroid to appear. If you shoot it, you get sent to the black hole, which is basically a warp zone. I'll show that to you in the, uh, in a special video. Won't be using it, because, like I said, I'm going to be going through this show you all the stuff. At least to the best of my sorry ass ability. Yeah. Well, that's the habit. Gee, what's going to kill me? The enemies or my own freaking sorry ass flying ability? Alright, just take these guys out. Yeah, if you take... Whoa, hello. Take that out three times. Yeah, there we go. Now we have the second enemy, the Rock Crusher. Simple matter, drop a bomb. Unfortunately, I missed, but oh well. So we're just gonna. I don't want to waste too many bombs. If one bomb misses, I ain't gonna waste too much. So I'm gonna try and save him for harder bosses. All right, one more, one more little laser turret here. Come on, hurry up and activate! Assholes. There's no nothing there. You're wasting my time. Thank you. And then we have the schmuck himself. Oh. And whoo, with a little bit left of our shields, no less. <laughs> whoo. 
Yeah, of course. Lovely. Yeah, I'm not perfectly jamming. Look at my freaking shields. When the hell y'all gonna come and back my ass up when I need you to, you punks? Freaking barnyard assholes. Ah, oh, so fracking close. Missed like probably one enemy. And now, light speed. Not ridiculous speed. Definitely not. Wait, are we going to plaid now? Ah, oh, crap. <laughs> But now, the next battle. Space Armada. Which will happen next time on the big man play Star Fox. Hope I said it the first time. Make a wish. Till next episode, it's Big Fatty Plus, Sayonara, and let's hope th this next battle won't be as rocky as the last one.